so we're driving with my cousin Yurek right now uh, in his tiny little Fiat. He's a little bit of a maniac driver, but it's all good. Here with my cousin who was uh, bought a car wreck and he's getting it fixed. Uh, it's a much better deal to get in a car wreck fixed than buying a brand new car, so he's getting all the parts for it, so I gotta hang around while he supervises all the mechanics. Tomorrow morning I'm off to Teplice, but tonight I have a slide and video presentation at uh, Paragliding Cafe, so that'll be interesting. I'm going to meet a lot of contacts and get more leads to meet more Cinderella. So. Cześć! Latasz na padalotnie? Nie, nie jestem. Nie? No. Przyjaźnie się z padalotnie. Nie? Przyjaźnie. Stefan! So good to see you, eh? Hey, it's been a while. Here we are with Sebastian, a good old filmmaking friend, and uh, we're at our little paraholic uh, weekly meeting here in Krakow, and it was nice enough of him to come and uh, meet up, and hopefully we'll be traveling west together. So, Sebastian, you think I'm going to find my Cinderella? <laughs> I hope so. What? When? I hope so. Well, uh, we're on a train going to Rotswap. Uh, we had to stop the train because we were late. The train was already starting, but we the conductor stopped it and we jumped on. Well, the MJ. We finally meet again. Andre alive. <laughs> yeah. I kept in touch with J because he's totally connected to the whole Polish paragliding community. We met over the internet a few years ago. I came up with the wildest idea of having the world's first paraplegic paragliding competition in Headley, British Columbia. And there was J from Poland. J knew everybody. He still competed in paragliding. He did a lot of trips. And he was my whole resource of knowledge as far as paragliding goes in Poland. showed me around the old wonderful square of Wroclaw. <laughs> it's a nice change from the woods. <laughs> His hometown, Wroclaw, happened to be right on the crossroads to a lot of places I was going. Yonje basically set me up with virtually everybody I met in Poland. And we are headed to Teplice. Hello, Alec. Hello. Are continuing my search for the flying Cinderella, which we will continue in Teplice. Hopefully, there'll be some nice, hard bodied outdoor women there to meet. <laughs> <laughs> we hope. We hope. <laughs> now I have to take my dog. Okay. Ciao. Ciao. We are on the festival grounds in Teplice. Teplice. Beethoven spent time here. He spent time writing love letters for a whole collection of letters called Immortal Beloved. Sometimes I wonder if my love for flying is like his love for music. His music sure took him away from the relationships and sometimes the flying takes me away too. Po únoru výstavu v Praze, kde představíme vlastně nějaký další kousky z naší kolekce, tak... The judges are getting ready. <laughs> we are in Teplice getting ready to watch our first films. We're going to do some internet surfing, see if any Cinderella's showed up on my, on my email. Do 
Dzisiaj już wiem małpę. <laughs> Received a letter, a nice email from Jenny. Yeah, that was the girl. The girl of my dreams from Peru. I sent her some pictures and she really yearns for a life of adventure. Maybe we can somehow rescue our relationship in the future. <laughs> the judges are taking a break. <laughs> a good place for finding your she, wife. Would she qualify? A catapulted woman? She's no, she has to fly. She has right. to fly. Has to fly. But, but if she is brave, she might be doing no this. No exception. No exception. What do you think of this? Of what exactly? Of your filmmaking? No, no, of, of this. <laughs> uh, I, I am waiting to see what happens. I never saw it before. <laughs> yeah, I haven't I'm either. Sure I haven't either. I will either. not be part of it. No. <laughs> so I'm just walking to the festival. We got seven more films to judge and watch. And. Uh, then enjoy the festivities and maybe go for a little paraglide flight. For the cameraman who combined his skills with the outstanding performance of the athletes in the, in the film Play Gravity. And I'm still looking for my flying Cinderella, but I'm having a good time uh, drinking great Czech beer and uh, drinking Gilone or green. Sometimes I would just get caught up in the whole tremor of the dance. But at other times, I would always feel like an outsider, just looking, looking at it and capturing it on my camera. Charnagura. The conditions look nice, so hopefully we'll have a nice flight. I don't know if we'll climb out, but such a pleasure to be flying in a, in a new country. Pemberton, how are you doing, guys? I'm here with Peter already again. <laughs> Ciao. That's so funny. <laughs> we fly a lot together back home. <laughs> another day, another festival. Here we are at the Cine Soku, and now I have to find the Art Gallery of Fine Arts where Sebastian is filming. We'll see what's going on. I came to the Zakopane Mountain Film Festival hoping to meet some of these hard-bodied women that climb and maybe even paraglide. Unfortunately, it ended up to be mainly guys that did all the climbing in the contests. Then, on the climbing outing, I met Martina Kusper, world's best female sport climber. I also learned that Martina wanted to base jump. Therefore, I thought it was natural for her to learn paragliding. I hope I will learn to fly. Oh, you will. Especially since Slovenia had some of the best flying in all of Europe. 
We spent the day filming rock climbing all day. But then I learned that paragliding was just too slow and tame for Martina. So she was definitely not going to be that Paris Cinderella I was looking for. Thank mm -hmm. you.